eight different knots to join two ropes together. Starting with the square knot, the most common. So start with right over left, left over right. There's the square knot. Next up is the surgeon's knot. This is similar to the square knot and you start right over left, but you do an additional wrap around and then you do left over right. This cinches up differently than the square knot, so you're gonna to have to let it slide into place. There's additional friction here for a better hold. Next up is the sheet bend, which is perfect for ropes of different sizes. With your larger rope, make a bend in it. Bring a smaller rope up that, wrap it around, and tuck it underneath. And pull the tighten. There is the sheet bend. Next up is the double sheet bend. This starts the same way, bend in the larger rope, bring the smaller rope up the hole, wrap it around, and bring that underneath, and repeat that process. And you can cinch that up. The double sheet bend. Next is the Carrick bend. So make a loop with one of the ropes, bring your other rope underneath that, and then you're going to go over, under, over, underneath the blue rope, and over the last one. Then you cinch that up here. And it comes together like that. Next is the hunter's bend. So bring one rope around the other one and underneath itself and bring it back up towards the top. Bring your opposing rope around underneath itself and then up through that overhand loop and then back underneath. Cinch it up. The hunter's knot. Next is the Ashley bend. So bring them around each other like that and bring the ropes over themselves. Make a hole in the middle between these two ropes and then bring both of your ropes up through that hole. Hold on to those while you cinch this up. Then when you get close, you can let go and then pull to tighten. And there is the Ashley bend. There are eight knots to connect two ropes together. Thank you.